Yep, I'm back. Bro, Colonel Sanders rides a horse to school. Fucking ROLE PLAYER! <laughs> Oh, Colonel, my Colonel. <laughs> I just got kicked in the face by a horse. Oh, sick. Natural seasoned musk. <laughs> Jacob, do I compliment the craftsmanship of the horse's shoes that just kicked me in the face, or do I... Lean in for a kiss. I don't care. <laughs> Why don't you make like a bee and mind your own wax, honey? What? Not even from a stand mixer? <laughs> mm. No, your mother was a stand mixer. <laughs> These guys are challenging me to a cook-off, I think. Do I accept or not accept? <laughs> Mama didn't raise no bitch. You're on. A bit of lunchtime competition, eh? Count me in if I have to wipe the tables with you fools before I set my lunch down on it. Then so be it. Oh, Seven. shit. What? That heavy got Shrek, dude. What? Oh, that would have killed him. Oh, shit. I'm so bad at this Your game. Your classmates bro. are rooting for you, but actually, you're simply stronger and faster than you. Why am I using a shotgun? What the hell? I'm supposed to be using the gun boots. It's probably why I died so fast. Probably. Fuck, I died. <laughs> 100 degrees Celsius, that's right. Gang, You're going to gang. need to season the chicken before you cook it. You don't know how many herb spices. 11. Yes! Tail wagging intensifies. Now that you've got some basic steps going, it's time to elevate your craft. What state of mind offers the most flavor? Gratitude. Yes! You must never take the opportunity for granted. If you hope to succeed, your classmates are rooting for you, but actually you're simply stronger and faster than you. You better pick up the pace if you want to survive. Were you a ch when you were a child, your father told you to never forget where you came from. Every day you meditate on on his advice and draw energy from Excuse me, what is happening? <laughs> Fucking so where did you come from? Y yes! I really You try to shout. Uh, the Did you say and I oop? <laughs> no, the dog made f the, uh, No, the teacher's a dog what? and he howled. <laughs> you try to shut out what the, the noise of the arena to focus what on your game. Oh, <laughs> what is the sound of success? Silence. That's right. When they taste your cooking, they will be so taken with it that they'll be unable to speak. You what? notice Colonel Sanders in the corner of your eye. I, b I believe in you, Ashleepius. <laughs> He's actually cheering you on. Which would be awesome, except knowing he's watching you makes you totally forget what you were doing. Now all you can imagine, now all you can think about is Colonel Sanders. Oh, How many spoons oh, of gravy? I killed him. All I can think about is the Colonel. Oh my you god! You are stranded on a desert island with only one desert cook dessert cookbook. What do you take? What a hunk! I know, right? Uh, okay. What is happening? Are you dating the Colonel now? No, not yet. You're really struggling to keep up. The next station over, Ashley has already begun plating elements of her dish. It's colorful and complex. And then you toss your biscuit dough into the stand mixer as you do the- An enemy stand mixer? <laughs> yeah. I knew you were gonna make a joke, <laughs> a joke somewhere in there. You might Is not have- You might not have any hands, but a joke doesn't- and a good chef needs to be touching the dough. You need to put them mixed. That's easy way and a hard way. You don't get far by going the easy way. When you hear everyone talk, taking, talking, you realize your serious error was. 
You immediately shove your hands into the mixer and rescue oh, your dough before it's over, miss. A sleepiest, no! But you're not fast no. enough, and your hand gets stuck. It's immediately crushed by the quick spinning beater, and no way no. you'll be able to use that hand for the rest of the match. Colonel Sanders shakes his head in shame. What you often find is the easiest way can turn out much, much difficult. Everyone stops yeah, what they're doing. Like, the battle is over. Bro, you, sh you shame the colonel. It like, can't be. I was so close to finishing my dish. Sweetheart, looks, look at your hand. You simply yeah, can't go on. Oh, uh, that's too bad. Point. I'm here in my completed dish ready to serve. <laughs> Surely that makes the winner be the... No, no, it wouldn't be fair to compare the two on account of Ashlipius' injury. He's this spy is going to lick his doggy me, chops as he looks into this. <laughs> As he places a sauce-covered finger into his lips, Ashley leans over and whispers something into his ear. A dab of sauce sticks to his mustache. I'll internalize my rage <laughs> that she's getting too close to me. I'm kind of about to catch fire. The flames cause your eyebrows to catch fire and turn to ash. And they fall off of your face, which means people will have a hard time understanding your emotions for the rest of the semester, perhaps forever. Embarrassed and ashamed by your poor performance, not to mention your crispy fried brow, <laughs> you run for the quad to be alone. It's Colonel Sanders. He's probably here to tell you that he and Ashley are in love and have decided to get married. He won't even ask you to cater his wedding because you're a terrible chef and an awful person. <laughs> <laughs> that escalated quickly. I'm fine. Can't you leave me alone? I'm a loser. I'm not fit to fill your fryer. <laughs> <laughs> I'll never be a master chef. Failure is a part of life. Not just for you, but for all of us. Do you think I've never failed at anything before? That's exactly what I think. Medic, please help me. Medic, no, why are you leaving me? Medic, come back. You just left us. Medic, come back. Well, then think again. Oh, I wasn't always the man you see before you. Enrolled in culinary school, incredibly handsome, successful, motivated. Well, handsome, sure. I was born that way. But I've walked <laughs> other paths and arrived at dead ends. I was passionate about life, but I failed as an... Ooh... That's a big word I don't know how to pronounce, but I'm probably just stupid. Obstetry... Ob... No, fuck it. I was passionate about justice, but I failed as a lawyer. I was passionate about livestock, but even I failed as a mule handler. That one, what? That one was especially humiliating. Mules, mules can be so cruel. I lost my business partner to, partner to a gunfight. And I lost my innocence when I picked up a firearm and put a bullet in my rival. He survived yeah, for a while. <laughs> he survived for a while, anyhow. I don't. I didn't Didn't know. the colonel actually shoot someone? <laughs> I think that's really cool, though. I think they're. In, I think they're incorporating. He, he shot like, someone in a turf war. I think he actually. I think they're like incorporating all of the actual Colonel Sanders lore into this game. All the Colonel Sanders <laughs> lore. People see my d delicate ribbon tie and my well-kept beard, and assume that I've got it all together. Which is true now, but it hasn't always been. Sounds like this guy could really use a hug. You've gotta be kidding, random crit kills me, bro. I this game is bad. I resolved then that I was going to amount to something. That amount, no amount of hours, labors, or money would deter me from giving the best I had to give. One has to remember. I like that face. One has to remember that every failure can be a stepping stone to something better. You've got to be kidding me! I died to another random clip from the same guy. It's something that a humble man in a <laughs> crisp white suit could be proud of. I will create a new chain of chicken restaurants that will bring joy to the entire world and make up for my past misdeeds. A personal invite. You can't imagine what Colonel Sanders' home must be like, but it sounds like you're about to find out.